guys, it's me, Presley, and today we're going to be trying a ton of Adopt Me hacks. We're even going to be trying to trade bucks. And before we get started, guys, make sure to hit that subscribe button. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you doing? Make sure to subscribe. If that subscribe button's gray, you guys are awesome. Thank you so much. You guys can hit the like button. But guys, if the subscribe button is red, what on earth are you doing? Make sure to make it gray right now. And let's do a little game. Let's make a three second challenge. So let's see if you can like and subscribe in three seconds. Okay, guys, are you ready for this challenge? Press on me, you guys know what to do. Comment down below, mega fan, if you guys do it in this three seconds. All right, are you ready? Let's do it in three, two, one, done. Guys, did you do the challenge in three seconds? If you did, comment down below, mega fan. And guys, let's stop right and jump down to the main center. Guys, we're fine. Usually we fly across the map, but today we just bounced. I'm sure our legs are broken, but at least we weren't thrown across the map. Yay! Okay, so this first hack is going to let us hatch a legendary every single time. This is awesome. But before we try that one, guys, don't forget that I'm doing massive Robux giveaways every single day. Here are some new winners. I give away Robux every single day. So if you want to win some free Robux, all you need to do is leave a like, subscribe, and comment down below your Roblox username. If you want some extra entries, go follow me over on my Instagram and subscribe to my family channel Empire Fam. And guys, once you do all of those, you have a bunch of entries into the draw to win. Okay guys, so let's get started and let's see what we have to do to hatch a legendary every single time. I gotta tell you something I could do. I could be running or I'm chasing you. But I won't. Okay, so this one looks pretty cool. Let's head into the nursery, grab some eggs, and try this one out. If we can actually hatch a legendary from this, though, that's just going to be so crazy. Guys, let me know down in the comments below, what's the best thing you've ever hatched from an egg? Have you guys hatched a legendary before? When you hatch a legendary, it just feels the best. You know what feels really bad, though, guys? When you're having a hatching battle with your sister, and she hatches a legendary turtle right in front of you. <laughs> All right, guys, hit the like button for good luck for me, guys. Let's really hope that this is a legendary. Come on. What? <laughs> oh, my gosh. Guys, I got a legendary turtle. Oh, my gosh. I'm so excited. This is awesome. <laughs> it's the worst feeling, especially when it's a hatching battle and you've tried for about three months to get a legendary from an Aussie egg and you haven't. It's just annoying. Hopefully, guys, we're going to feel all those good feels and hatch a legendary today. Let's get an Aussie egg like they use because I think that it will work for an Aussie egg and I really want to get a turtle today. So I can just say to my sister, hey, I know you got a turtle in the hatch off battle, but look at me. Okay, guys, I've got some good vibes about this egg. Let's go. Let's buy an Aussie egg. And guys, there we go. Guys, while I'm looking at my Aussie egg, I see this guy waving behind my Aussie egg. It's Doug and we need to check if he has pants. If you guys are in the pretzel army, you guys would know how long I've been trying to get pants on Doug. And he just doesn't wear pants to work every day. Please, just put pants on. Look, I'm gonna look away for 10 seconds and this is the time where you can pull those pants out of your back pocket. I just realized Doug doesn't have pants so he can't pull pants out of his back pocket. This is the part where you can put on pants. Okay, time's up, Doug. Have you got your pants on? We're gonna have to jump over, guys, and take a look. Does Doug have pants on? No, Doug! Pretzel army, he still doesn't have pants on. Go get the Doug Needs Pants merch, guys, because Doug, he needs pants. We need to get this message through to Adopt Me, guys, and then Adopt Me can tell Doug to put some pants on because, gee, he needs pants. Hashtag it down below, guys. We've been trying for so long to get pants on Doug. Let's go, guys. Let's try this hack. And Doug, next time I see you, you're going to be wearing pants. You're going to be proud of yourself. You're going to make your mum proud because you're wearing pants. But just before we leave, guys, I actually want to buy a cracked egg to try this hack. So let's go, let's head over to the school, guys. And usually you would have to do the tasks, but I'm actually going to be auto hatching this egg today. So let's go and let's hope that we can get a legendary from this cracked egg. Okay, guys, so we're in the school and I don't know exactly where we have to do this in the school, but I'm standing next to Petrina Shane. Maybe he will give us some good luck. Let's stand right next to him. Okay guys, so we've got our Aussie egg out and turns out we're meant to have a better chance of hatching a legendary in the school. Okay, so let's hatch this legendary using this school hack and let's see. Let's hatch now. <gasps> guys, we got a frog. That's so good. So turns out 
this hack actually ups our chances? It's an ultra rare frog. That's so crazy. It's not a legendary, guys, but it's so close to being one. It's an ultra rare, guys, so it's the next tier down. Oh my gosh, I think this hack actually ups your chances when hatching eggs. That's so crazy. Okay, guys, I'm going to say that this hack actually works. I'm going to say it does up your chances because usually we get bandicoots, dingoes, emus, and Australian kelpies, which are all commons and uncommons and rares. But today we got an ultra rare, which is really, really good. And we barely ever get frogs. This hack lets you get the pets that you don't usually get. That's so crazy. Okay, guys, so for this hack, I've shown you part of it before, but now there's a second and even better part to it. So let me show you. Elsa's going to be driving a car today. This is going to be awesome. So the first part that you want to do is you want to go into dress up and you want to get the Elsa outfit. I did show you guys how to do this in my last video, but if you guys didn't see last night's video, let me show you. But guys, if you haven't seen last night's video, what are you doing? Make sure to go check it out after this one because I showed you even more awesome TikTok hack. You guys are going to love that video. Go check it out. So what you want to do for this is you want to just scroll down and forth from the bottom is this guy with really spiky hair and you want to click on it. Him. Then what you want to do is scroll down through all of these packages and if you click on one of these you actually turn into what the picture shows and this guy <laughs> It's a snowman with my hair. That's so crazy I just thought it looks like an angry Olaf because we're like talking about Elsa and stuff that just came to my mind So what you want to do you just want to scroll down and when you get to about halfway You'll find Elsa's outfit right here and what you want to do you will just want to click on it and then you become Elsa. It's pretty cool, guys. Next up, what you want to do is just go out of here and go into Tails. Only the, like, original Pretzel Army Mega fans will know what I used to call the Tails symbol. I didn't call it Tails. I called it something really whack. Comment down below if you guys know what I used to call it. But now what you want to do is you want to go and find a car. For example, this Jeep. That looks pretty cool. It's a Roblox Jeep. Or you could even use this Lamborghini. That looks pretty cool as well. There's so many cars for you to choose from. I think I'm going to go with the Lamborghini because if you guys know me, you know I love Lamborghinis. <laughs> but guys, what you want to do now is you want to exit out. And this hack is you can actually go. You want to go into actions, sit, and take a look, guys. Now we are flying through the Adopt Me map. Take a look. We're just gliding along. And we're crashing into trees. It's so crazy, guys. And I did show you this hack, but I totally didn't think about putting a car on it. Like, Elsa is now driving a car, and this is, like, the fastest vehicle in all of the game. But, guys, I figured out another part to this hack. Nobody knows about it yet. But what you want to do is you want to go actions, sit, and then just steer it. Yesterday, I did say that you can't steer it. But if you go into shift lock and move your shift lock around, you can actually steer it and control which way you're going. Without shift lock, you just go straight and you have no idea where you're going. But when you have shift lock, you can make turns and you can just go around the Adopt Me map however you want to. But this isn't even the best part, guys. The best part is you can actually spawn this indoors. So it's like having a vehicle indoors, guys. Let's head, let's escape and reset my characters so we can head to my house and let me show you. You can even make like a little racetrack, which is pretty cool. So let's go, let's action sit. And as you can see, we can do it around our house. And I don't have a racetrack right now, but I do have a party room for my sister's birthday party, which is pretty cool. And you can just go around your house. Oh. It doesn't work in a pool. Okay, perfect time to get on to the next hack. Okay guys, so this one is all of the hacks that you can do in the chat. And guys, there are so many hacks. There's even one to be able to trade bugs. And guys, people have been talking about trading bugs. They've made little ideas of what it will look like. A dummy hasn't released it into the game yet. But it turns out, if you say something special in the chat, it lets you trade bugs. Like a dummy's put in a secret system. Okay guys, so what we want to do now is we want to go into the chat and we want to do forward slash question mark. And guys, I'm confused about this one as well. Turns out it's meant to do something special. So if we say it in the chat, whoa, we can put commands in the chat. Okay, forward slash C is channel. Switch channel menu. What's channel? Guys, you can mute people. Or oh, if you don't like somebody on the server or they're like spamming stuff in the chat, you can just do forward slash mute and then their username. <laughs> Imagine that! Someone's trying to talk to you and you're like, uh, mute you. Imagine if you could do that in real life. Just to the bullies, you like, grab a remote, point it at them and you're like, mute. And then they just can't talk. Oh, and there's also this special one. Forward slash E, Chia. This one looks so cool, guys. Woohoo! 
It's like you're cheering. And guys, there's so many other ones as well. There's forward slash E dance. I always love this dance. It's the Roblox dance. It's so funny, guys. And next up, what other ones are there? Oh, forward slash E wave. That's a fun one as well. I love all the forward slash ones because you can do these like special emotes. Let's do forward slash E laugh as well, guys. Uh, forward slash E laugh. And we laugh as well. I just love the forward slash E ones because there's so many that you can do. Wait, did that say whisper? We can whisper with someone to open a private message channel with a speaker. Oh, so it's private messaging. That's how people do it. That's cool, guys. You can actually do private chats. That's a really awesome one. I'm definitely going to use that with my friends. All right, guys, but we need to try this one. The forward slash console one, because it's a really cool one. And you can see how much money people have. Let's go forward slash console. And then if we say in the chat, guys, take a look. Look at all of this! Right now I'm on a private server, guys, so there's not much happening. But if you're on a public server, guys, you can see what everybody's doing. It's so crazy. You can see what eggs people have hatched, you can see where they are, and there's just so much stuff you can see. If you're playing hide and seek, definitely use this, because you will be the winner, because you know where everybody is. Wait, I just thought, I play hide and seek with a pretzel army, and I give you guys prizes when you find me, but what if you're just using the console hack? Well done to you, because it means you've been watching my videos. And if you guys are watching my videos, you deserve to be rewarded. And another part of this hack is you can actually type in money up in the search bar, and you can see how much everybody has, how much money everybody has. I'm not gonna do it, guys, because I know how much money I've got. If you do this on a public server, guys, you can see everybody's money. And if someone's saying, Oh, I'm poor, give me free pets! Then you can actually go, and you can see how much money they have. If you search up their username, look at how much money they have, and bam, you know if they're poor or not, and if you should give them free pets. Okay, so this is the big one, guys. Let's see if the forward slash trade bucks hack works. Let's go, guys. Forward slash trade bucks. Oh my gosh. If this works, this is going to be so crazy. We'll be able to trade bucks and adopt me. Let's go. Let's say in the chat. Wait, maybe we need a space between trade and bucks. Forward slash trade bucks, like that with a space. Wait, what if we try forward slash E trade bucks, like that? that? What? It's not letting... Can you guys try it and let me know if it works for you? Let me know down in the comments below if you've tried it and if it works. Oh, this is so crazy. I really wanted this one to work, guys. But this is what I thought it would look like if we could trade bucks. I think we'll be able to trade, like, our items and then also our bucks down the bottom. So we can type in, I want to trade this person 600 bucks for their neon cash or something like that. And then people can make money and sell their pets. And guys, you won't get scammed when you're buying pets because you have to press accept and you have to give them the money at the same time they give you the pet. So there's no way that people can scam you with this one. But Adopt Me did say that they're working on a trading update that's going to be coming with the fossil egg update. So maybe, just maybe, we'll be able to get trading bugs in the future update. If we do, That'll just be so awesome. I really want to get trading bucks. Comment down below if you guys want to be able to trade bucks and adopt me. For this one, we need to go to a secret location and then we get a legendary pet from an egg. Guys, we got so close in our last hack, so let's hope that this one works. Okay guys, so like usual, I'm doing perfect parking out here. And guys, no, I'm not gonna be rude. I'm not gonna be a Karen and block the front door so nobody else can buy anything. I'm just gonna do it next to the front door. Okay, so let's head to this secret location, guys. And this one is in the nursery. I don't know why I just got back in my carriage. But guys, let's head in the nursery and let's get to this secret spot. So how do you get there? It's a pretty easy way to get there. Do you want to go up to this big window where it says babies on top of there? You want to go to the top of these stairs and then you want to go into your backpack, go into toys, and pull out any type of grappling hook. The plunger grappling hook works the best. And what you want to do, you want to click on this rock and then after a few tries, it should work. You can even like put your camera out here, click over here and bam guys, you get straight out just like that. And guys, this is actually the secret spot outside of the dome. But the secret spot for the hack guys is up here on top of the dome. So let's head up there. Let's use our grappling hook to get over there. Boop. What happened? We were stuck in the roof, guys, and now we're back inside the dome. We're gonna have to do the hack again. Come on! 
Okay, so we're back on the rock. Let's head over to the top of the dome and hope that it works this time and hope that we don't get stuck inside. Okay, guys, we're on the top and check this out. How cool does this look? We're on top of a glass dome. Okay, guys, so we just turned nine and now we need to take out our egg. And turns out this hack works with any egg. We just want to do the last task or auto hatch it up here at the highest point in the nursery. And guys, let's go. I think we're going to use a royal egg for this hack because I think... I think it's going to be really, really cool with a royal egg. So let's pull one out, guys. And it likes... It's an upside down royal egg. It's just chilling upside down on a glass roof. Upside down. That was weird. Anyway, guys, let's pick up our royal egg. Okay, so what you want to do, guys, is do the last task up here or auto hatch it. Okay, let's do it, guys. Let's hatch our legendary... But guys, we didn't get a legendary, but we still got a rabbit. And that's a rare pet, which is pretty good. Okay, so go try these hacks out for yourselves. Let me know down in the comments below if they work for you. And guys, don't forget to enter my massive Roblox giveaway. All you need to do to enter is leave a like, subscribe, and comment down below your Roblox username. If you want some extra entries, go follow me over on my Instagram and subscribe to my family channel. And guys, I'll see you in the next awesome video. Have the best day ever, guys. Yeah. Peace.